Hi, my name is Grafton, and today we will take a look at the Trezor Safe 3. Setting up a Trezor wallet is easy and intuitive, so let's get into it. Your Trezor package will arrive with a security seal, guaranteeing that no one has opened the box before you. Please ensure that the seal is intact when you receive your device, just like this. If it appears tampered with or broken, kindly contact us immediately. If everything is all right, remove the seal. Inside the box, you will find your Trezor device, get started pack, seed cards, a user manual, and a set of stickers and a USB cable. Your new Trezor arrives wrapped in a protective foil. Peel it off to reveal its sleek design. To assure that the device remains untampered with, each device has a holographic seal over the USB port. If the seal is intact, you can be confident your Trezor is safe to use. Trezor Safe 3 comes in four premium colors, Solar Gold, Stellar Silver, Galactic Rose, and Cosmic Black. Once you've removed the holographic seal, connect your Trezor to a computer to start managing your wallet. So let's follow the step-by-step -step guide to setting up your Trezor Safe 3. Once connected to your computer, you will be directed to trezor.io slash start. There, download and install our custom wallet app, Trezor Suite. This app is also available as a web version for on-the-go use. Once installed, launch Trezor Suite and follow the on-screen instructions. Trezor Suite will then ask for a security check. Confirm that your package was intact and the holographic seal over the USB port was unbroken. Should everything check out, you'll proceed to the firmware installation. I can't stress this enough. Always purchase your device directly from the official Trezor eShop or an authorized reseller and ensure the package is undamaged. To ensure you load the official firmware directly from us, we ship each Trezor without pre-installed firmware. Trezor Suite will offer you the latest firmware. Click on Install Firmware to initiate the installation. Next, validate the authenticity of your Trezor. This confirms that the chip inside your Trezor is genuine. Trezor Suite will then guide you through a tutorial to help you understand your device better, including how to confirm actions by pressing the button and more. So what's next? It's backup time. This is a crucial step in case your Trezor is lost or damaged and you can choose between a regular seed and Shamir backup. For now, let's proceed with the regular seed backup. Once your wallet is set up, you'll be shown a series of seed words that correspond to your new wallet. Take a moment to carefully write down these words. They can restore access to your wallet in case of emergency. And make sure you understand this. Never take a photo or make a digital copy of your backup. Keeping it secure is essential. Confirm that you understand directly on the device's screen and your Trezor will reveal your 12 seed words. This one is really important, so pay close attention. Write the seed words on the seed card one by one. Click the button to reveal each word. Once you write down all the words, confirm this on your Trezor. You'll then be asked to verify the seed to ensure it's written down correctly. Remember, your seed represents your wallet. A great tip is to use a seed protection device like our Trezor Keep Metal to safeguard your seed from fire and other damage. After backing up, you'll now set a pen. This sequence of numbers adds another layer of protection to your device. Make sure to select a strong pin. We suggest at least four digits and don't use your birth date or any other easy to guess number. And don't even think about using one, two, three, four. Here's where you can set up a passphrase. Think of this as an additional security step. By using a passphrase, you're effectively adding an extra word to the seed phrase, creating a brand new hidden wallet. Finally, You'll activate your coins. Trezor supports more than 7,000 coins and tokens, and you can add your favorite one now, or add it later if you prefer. And that's it. You've successfully set up your Trezor. Let's also see how you generate a receiving address so you can deposit coins onto your new wallet. In the Trezor Suite app, go to your account and click on Receive. Your wallet will generate a new address. By the way, Trezor gives you a fresh address every time for better privacy. 
You should always check the address and other transaction details on your Trezor screen to see if it matches the one displayed in Trezor Suite. With Trezor, every piece of sensitive information such as the address is shown truthfully on your Trezor's display. That's how you know it's genuine. And that's it. Congratulations, you've just successfully set up your new Trezor. If you like this video and found it helpful, share it with everyone you know, including your Meemaw.